Hi, it's Sasha here from the NOCO. In this video, I'm going to talk to you about post mastectomy bras. Hit the like button, do leave a comment, subscribe to the channel, and if you'd like to find out about our full range of mastectomy bras, breast prostheses, or pocketed swimsuits that we supply here at Lenoco, follow the link below to the website. A mastectomy bra should be comfortable and it should also provide support. Things to look out for in a mastectomy bra is that the underband is wide that the cups are full, the seams are soft, and that the straps are adjustable. Depending on where you are on your cancer journey, you might find that you need a different type of bra. And I'm just going to run through some of the bras and their uses, depending on the stage that you might find yourself at. So initially after surgery, a front fastening bra may be a good option. Um, this can be maybe due to um, the reduced movement that you have in your arm on the side that you've had the surgery so this just allows for you to be able to fasten the bra at the front as opposed to fastening at the back which you might find a little bit more difficult like say if the range of movement in your arm is reduced. A front fastening bra also um, allows for you to um, get at wounds uh, a little bit easier so that you know when you when you open up the bra at the front that if the, the dressings need to be changed it just means that um, you can get to it a little bit easier. These can also be useful during radiation uh, treatment because again uh, it allows for easy access so it means that you're not trying to take on and off your bra. So something like the front faced, uh, front fastening bra might be a, a good option during that time. Now your um, breast surgeon or breast care nurse may recommend that you use something like a compression garment uh, bra uh, during initially after surgery and this what this does is that it reduces the buildup of fluid so you know this might be a, a way to address this um, and also then uh, we use this then in relation to the management of lymphedema so if you've ever concerned about any swelling on the chest wall um, or buildup of fluid do talk to your healthcare provider about it because uh, it's important to keep an eye on, on those things. The other thing during initially after surgery that you may find useful is a sports bra. Now initially what we would we would recommend is a sports bra that's uh, low to, uh, to medium impact sorry um, and again this provides support um, and then post uh, you know uh, six to eight weeks post surgery um, you know you'll be able to get back to um, some uh, a level of, of activity that you were uh, pre-surgery um, so something like sports bra is good to have in your wardrobe because it means then that um, it's providing you with that support uh, especially to get back to being active which is important for your well-being and also for me from a health point of view as well now if you do find that you have a sports bra that you like um, um, or you find that it, it's quite good and it doesn't have a pocket in it just to say that we can get pockets sewn into bras, so that, that might be another option. But a sports bra is a good thing to, to have in your wardrobe because um, it is important, like I said, to get back and being active. For ladies who've had lumpectomies or partial mastectomies um, and that they feel maybe that they, they, they don't need to use a breast prosthesis, something like um, a padded, molded t-shirt bra could be uh, an option because like I say the the cups are padded so it just gives a, a smoother um appearance under clothes so something like like this one and um, this t-shirt bra the, the the padding is is a little bit um stiffer but it's it's still quite soft okay so then day-to-day -day bras um something like this is is quite good and um, it's quite deep here at the front the pocket, the, um, the cups are, are full and the straps are, are wide and um, some people find that maybe they don't like these wide straps and they prefer the thinner ones which is okay too but we, we kind of do say you know if you can go for, for straps that are, are a little bit uh, wider it just helps with uh, neck and uh, shoulder pain but if you find that you prefer the thinner ones you could use something like a bra strap cushion uh, to that you slip under the bra straps and this just allows for weight distribution and this can help with the reduction in neck and shoulder pain. So this is a good kind of day-to-day -day bra. 
Now, of course, there's times when you have that special outfit that you need, uh, you know, a particular type of bra or a particular type of colour. So do talk to your bra fitter about that. Uh, there's lots of them out there. Um, and it's important to, to have the right bra for uh, that special occasion because it just makes you feel different and it makes your outfit sit differently on you as well. So this is quite a nice feminine bra and again it's got the uh, the bilateral pockets inside for the, the prostheses um, and it's just kind of got that see-through through area but you you know your, your breast prostheses is not going to come up there so it's it's quite secure but it's giving you just that little bit of a little bit of extra detail as well which is which is quite nice and then this is another nice one here as well it's just got a little bit of lace detail um, and again the the straps are wide um, and that the underband is 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 quite wide as well and that the cups are full so that's it if you'd like to view any of these products or uh, any other products do follow the link below to the website uh, do get in touch uh, if, either via social media or email or do ring us um, to find out more about the mastectomy bras breast prosthesis or pocket swimsuits that we have here at Lenoco. thanks for watching